Need some high-tech gift ideas for your list? Our correspondent Malou Nubla checked out some really cool stuff. Watch. It's absolutely gorgeous here. I'm in Redmond, Washington. Take a look at this. Enjoying nature and talking about cool gift ideas with Mike Foley of the Bluetooth Special Interest Group. Hi, Hello. Mike. Hello, Malou. Welcome to my house. And welcome to Designing Spaces. We're talking all about uh, Bluetooth, and that is a Bluetooth headset, right? Yes, it is. But before I get into what this is, let me tell you a little bit about Bluetooth technology. Bluetooth is a short-range wireless technology that allow devices to communicate with each other without having to plug them together. It's all done wirelessly. We like that. No wire. So it's kind of like a remote control. Exactly. But it does way more than a remote control. A camera can print to a printer. Mouse and keyboards can work with the PC. Uh, and of course, the mobile phone to a headset. Malou, let me tell you how these devices work. Typically, you have the headset on over your ear and the phone in your pocket. Then when the phone rings, you touch the headset, you answer the call, you talk to the person, take the call, and when you're done, hit the button again to end the call. You never have to touch the phone. Similarly, you can do the exact same thing with hands-free operations in the car. You keep your phone in your pocket or your purse, and then when the phone rings in the car, it rings on your car stereo, you hit a button and answer the call, and then you're able to talk to the person and again hit the button again to end the call without ever having to touch your phone. This has been so popular that in fact we added Bluetooth to a race car helmet that was used in the Mazda car series this year to enable the race car driver to speak to his pit crew and also in enhanced safety so that if the driver unfortunately crashed they were able to get out of the car easier because they weren't encumbered by wires. Let me show you another neat gift idea that I have. This is a Bluetooth equipped digital camera. Oh, nice. So let me come over and show you some of the things you can do with this. Okay. This is very nice, by the way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this is a gorgeous house. Yes, yeah, so I really enjoy the outdoor space here, the grilling, the fireplace, and the TVs. With this camera, what you can do, so many times people take hundreds of digital pictures but yet they're not able to share them with their family and friends. What this one enables you to do is take a picture and then instantly beam the picture wow. to a TV using Bluetooth. So the TV right here is also Bluetooth capable? There's an adapter to the TV that plugs into it that makes that enables it with Bluetooth. So now the Bluetooth has found the adapter on it and it's sending the picture to the TV. And you can see it's sending how much of the picture is gone. And when it's done, the picture will appear on the TV. Hey, look at that. That was fast. Yeah, and you can take 10, 20 pictures and have them send one at a time to create a slideshow on the TV as well. So you're able to instantly share the images with your family and friends. It's great for parties. Now that's easy to use too. Very simple to use. It's a traditional point and click camera with one extra menu option to be able to wirelessly send it to the TV. Uh, isn't that a great shot? Nice technology. Thank you. <laughs> yes. All right. Another great holiday gift idea is stereo audio. I showed you the voice headset earlier, but there's also headsets for stereo audio that allow you to stream music from a mobile phone player and an iPod with a Bluetooth adapter on it or an MP3 player. And you can, any of the MP3s that you have on your player, you can stream to the stereo headset and listen to music. However, in an environment like this that's open, it's also great to be able to stream to a traditional home type stereo. So that's what Bluetooth allows you to do as well. I like that, very cool. Yeah, isn't it wonderful? Let's go inside and I'll show you some more great gift ideas. Okay. Malou, remember that picture that I took outside? Yeah. Well, while we were walking in, I used Bluetooth to send it to the printer and print it out. And there it is. Instant gratification, I like it. <laughs> Excellent, and the printer isn't the only use. I can also send the picture via Bluetooth to a picture frame that you can put on, and this stores multiple pictures that you can send via Bluetooth. Okay. And look at this. This is my desktop personal computer, but it's all wireless. Look at that, nice. Yeah, very nice. The mouse and keyboard use Bluetooth to communicate with the desktop PC, 
and then there's no clutter on the desk. Yeah, so Bluetooth means wireless. Is it all easy to set up? Because obviously you don't have a bunch of wires to connect. It's very easy to set up. Typically it's one or two buttons to set it up, and once that's done, you just use it like normal. And with all the Bluetooth technology they have today, will uh, this be capable or compatible, I should say, with products in the future? Of course. Whenever a new product comes out containing Bluetooth, it's backwards compatible with devices already on the market. And so can I find Bluetooth products everywhere? Oh, virtually any electronics store in the U.S. has products that contain Bluetooth, but they're also available worldwide. Bluetooth is a global standard and products are used around the world. Now, do you have to look for that Bluetooth logo? Yes, the Bluetooth logo tells you that a product has Bluetooth wireless technology in it, whether it's the mouse, the keyboard, the camera, the printer, any of those products. It's got the little blue thing on it. Exactly, the Bluetooth logo. Mike, thank you so much for inviting us into your home. Lots of great gift ideas. It's my pleasure, Malou. Okay, so there you have it, folks. Absolutely no excuses. Now you know what to get people for the holidays because you saw it right here on Designing Spaces.